So, we're here for the Tomorrow People. How excited are you that fans are finally kind of getting a chance to experience this show? Very excited. You know, Craig's in my story about this show goes back to when I was eight years old and watching it on Nickelodeon um, that they'd imported from the BBC right when cable started. It was literally the advent of cable television and I was sitting there being very, very, very excited about this new show with these runaway teenagers that found each other and created a family. And, you know, it took me another 10, 15 years before I thought there's another person who'd ever heard of it in the form of Greg Berlanti. And then it took him 10 years, 15 years to figure out how to get it made again. So it's been a good, long journey. And, and now uh, I think it's going to be really exciting for people to be able to see it come to life. Well, given the nostalgia you have for this show, are you guys trying to like tap into elements of the original series that original fans will kind of take note of? Yeah, I mean, there's definitely... There's things that we've done and decisions that we've made that are straight up. We wouldn't dare do it any differently than the original series, you know. Um, and then there's little Easter eggs throughout, you know, the name, the name of a character, which is, you know, uh, references the original creator. Episode titles are a little shout out, stuff like that. Like fun for fans of the original series to kind of, you know, get a kick out of it.